welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori, and we're gonna put together a Valentine gift for my coworkers and Sarah's birthday present. She's coming today, and it's her birthday, and it's also Valentine themed. So I thought I would give you some ideas. I know it's a little late. Hopefully, um, it'll be helpful in any way this year or next year, or some ideas. Um, what you'll need, I used some of this twine. It was actually Christmas twine from, I guess, Michael's, but it's red and white. So I used some twine. I have some candy. I got these bags at the Dollar Tree. I also am using these plastic hearts from the Dollar Tree. Um, some of this crinkle cut paper. What's it called? Filler of some sort. Some scissors. And anything else. Stuff to fill. Candy. All right. So, let's flip you around and I will show you how I built this bag for the work. So easy. And then put Sarah's little gifty together or vice versa. We'll probably do the bag first since it's already out and I haven't figured out her little gift box yet. Okay, let's flip you around. Okay, so here's the bag. What it's going to look like when I put it on their desk. Um, it's just full of candies. Um, and this is what, here I'll show you the bag because it has some paper in this one. It's just a kitty, duh. And it says Happy Valentine's Day. There were 20 of them for $1 at um, the Dollar Tree. The plastic hearts came in a four pack and I have seen them still. And these are two pieces. And they came with their own little strings, these little string. And then each of them came with a little tag that says Happy Valentine's Day. But we're gonna use that sign on the outside. This is so easy, guys. I picked up some candies. I have two, if, this holds a lot, two Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, a uh, Hershey's Heart, and some Caramel Filled Kisses. Probably would hold a little more if I wanted to, but I think that's sufficient. The heart just kind of snaps together like that. And then what I did to keep the heart, I licked my finger, to keep the heart from popping apart in the bag. I'm just gonna fill it or close it up and then just tie this ribbon or tie the string, the string that came with the hearts. And it will hold them together enough. And then I'm just gonna open my bag. Like this is so easy. Put this heart down in there, and this will be great for kids' classroom, for teachers. You could put a gift card in here. There's a hundred things you could do. I grabbed some of the moon pies. So this is a chocolate one. There was white chocolate and milk chocolate. Um, I grabbed each of them a lollipop. So I'll throw that in here. Um, they got three little containers of six lits, which is just candy coated chocolate. And then these little hearts, candy heart packages are adorable. And that's it. There's all their candy. And then I'm just gonna tie it up. Like how easy was that? I don't even know if this needs a video, but I thought I would show you. Like I said, you could stick anything in here. Baked goods, if, um, if I was doing this, you know, I am doing this for my coworkers, but I could give them all kinds of stuff that, you know, I know them. So pens and things. But I'm just going to go with candy. And I made 16 of them, and that's enough. And I'll put one on everybody's desk. And it costs me, honestly, less than a dollar a bag with the candy. Most of this candy, or all of it, came from the Dollar Tree, except for the chocolates. And I got those with coupons. Um, so this whole bag was less than a dollar a piece. And then I'll just come in on Valentine's Day and pass them out to everybody. So there's that idea. Um, this would be a Valentine idea, but I'm happy to be doing it for a birthday. And she's getting the leftover candy. Sorry for the crinkle. This is called Decorative Shred, yeah. And I happen to have had it left over from Christmas, but guys, it's red. It's perfect, right? So I'm just going to stuff some in the bottom. Make it look pretty. Now that's all the candy I have. So we have our decorative shred. I grabbed her bag of Sour Patch Kids because I know she likes those. 
and I'll just put those down. And we're just going to build this up um, at the Dollar Tree. And I actually picked these up the other day. They're the four pack of Russell Stover hearts. And I'm going to stick these in here as well. My kind of goal, I'm wondering if I can get this to shut. We'll see. Other big thing I got was some pink Starburst. Because, you know, Valentine's Day. If you push your bottoms in, they fit in these. You can do this for any holiday either, too. The Itty Bitty Chocolate Hearts can go in here as well. Oh, I think I'm going to be able to do this, guys. I want to be able to shut it. And then when she opens it up, it's all the candy. So I have all of that in there. Perfect. Maybe I'll give her a moon pie. Here. Two little moon pies because I love her to the moon and back. I'll stuff some lollipops. And I don't have to give her all this candy. I mean, I will because I love her. And then I'm just going to fill in here and there with some of this other candy. And the rest I'll just take to work because, you know, I'm not eating it, right? Cichlids. We need these. She definitely needs these. And then the last thing that I'll put in is her gift card that I purchased to Lowe's. Let me just make sure that that will fit right on top. How's that looking, guys? Ooh, maybe not. Okay. Maybe I'll leave the lid open. <laughs> it's just not going to shut all the way. Um, but that is what her little box is going to look like. And I just filled it full of candy. And then her actual gift is a gift card. I wanted to get her some spring flowers for her house. And therefore, I will give her that gift card. And that is what she can do with that. So I hope you enjoyed my little ideas for Valentine's Day. I will try to get this out, or, you know, at least before Valentine's Day. And I'll figure out a way to get all this candy in there because she needs it. And I love her. And check out my vlog. Well, you'll probably have seen the vlog on Monday, but I'll do an update here real quick on what's going on with my cross stitch. All right, everybody. I will talk to you later. Bye.